Okay. So we are in draft phase. Okay. Uh, Akali, Karma, Thresh were banned. Set, Lulu, and Viego uh, are banned away. Oh, crap. Fiddle being hovered. Okay. So Gwyneth Paltrow picked up early. Roomble Gangplank, I think is, I mean, I think that's a totally fine R1, R2 rotation. I think it's a totally fine rotation. Um, okay, so I, I, mm, I don't mind TL's position in this current draft. However, it is kind of dicey because I don't think that Fly is necessarily that far behind. Um, it's really going to come down to the R4 here. I think the R4, so... Fly can really throw it on B4, B5, um, but TL could also equally punt it on, on R4. Uh, so the, the issue here is that I think that you need another multi-flex on R4 here. So I'm trying to think, like, what is even a multi-flex on R4? Because you don't want to lose bot lane support counterpick. Uh, because I think that guaranteeing Varus' success it should be the highest priority, more, more so than mid. Now, but Karma, Karma's banned, and so is Rulu, so you're not left with a lot of options. You could do something like Thought Seraphine, so but sure Seraphine's so pretty so bad here with the surrounding champions. So that one's not, um, that one's not super good. Plus on Thresh or Nautilus uh, on a solo lane. Yeah, I, I asked the question about Thresh before, but apparently he's just terrible. But, I don't know, I haven't looked at his scaling enough. His HP thing got buffed to where now he has more HP before, right, than he used to have, like level 15, but everything else about Thresh just keeps getting nerfed. Soraka on R4 could make sense because she can retain flex, um, but then if they if they do something like if they do something like Zareth or like Ziggs, and then uh, just you know generic support and bot, then it can get dicey. Well, I mean they were hovering Soraka, jeez. Yeah, they're gonna go with Nautilus because. We don't like in uncomfortable spots in the draft. So the thing is, is that you would have to have a multi-flex champ prepared on R4 here. You'd need a champion that's able to go both mid-top. Well, okay. You need a champ that's able to either go top support, or you need one that goes mid-top, or you one that uh, you need one that goes uh, support top or something. So there, there's a limited range of options that exist on R4. Um Okay, th this is also kind of like what you want to avoid. I mean, when, when opponents are, are going to be so thoughtless uh, as to pick, like, Braum here, um, it would have been a really good spot to obviously have a, a better champion. Yeah, the Braum pick is down bad. The, the, the Braum pick's horrendous. I mean, um, I, I'm pretty sure that, like, having Yumi here is actually not bad because you have Gwyneth Paltrow and you have... Uh... Okay, yeah, so... Um, FlyQuest definitely punting it here on B4, B5. Um, this is probably where most teams punt things. Most, yeah, this is, the, I, I, I think B4, B5 usually is where a lot of punting, uh, does take place. Um, I think Lissandra's, I don't know how to feel about Liss, uh, in, in this spot. Rise is, uh, Rise is, I guess, actually probably fine. Yeah, Rise is probably fine um let me let me look at some other champions here let me look at some other champs let me get the juices going i'm sure that there's a better pick than rise i'm just not thinking of it off the top of my head not every day that you stare down like that uh that b5 rotation um annie's too dicey hmm karma's banned kassadin is not good here maybe Maybe you can maybe you can take Orn. Maybe Orn is like possible. Yeah. Maybe Orn's possible. Thoughts on Cho'Gath support? Does he fit on a competitive scene? This is a generalization question. What was that? Thoughts on Cho so Cho support? Yeah, he can be picked. Um, generally, if you're gonna move him support, though, it's a pivot. All right. Let me make sure Cam is every and everything's right. Cool. All right, cool. Lissandra, I mean, I think it could have maybe been a Liss angle, but I think that Rise just does everything Liss is aiming to do, but better. Yeah, Liss are enchanters pickable and solo to learn mid lane. Yeah, they are. You can play. You can play Karma mid. Good luck. Have fun. Yeah. 
That's what they write in all chat. Okay. Let's see. So, Gwyneth Paltrow against Gangplank. Um, I think it's really, really, really bad to have Ignite. I think taking Ignite's really bad if the Gangplank's good. Um, so, I don't know if it if it's Licorice thinks that um, GP's bad or, or what. Uh, GP should move in right now. GP should have moved in and queued. GP should move in and queue. So, against uh, Gwyneth Paltrow, you take Time Warp Tonic. Um, you take time, uh, yeah, you take time warp tonic, um, against Gwyneth, um, because it's the only way to space her E. Um, and if you do that, Gangplank just moves at her. He should have Gangplank selected right now. He doesn't have Gangplank selected. Okay, Gangplank misses Q, auto, okay. And now he should move in at Gwen again. Well, he should just move in at Gwen. You, you want to basically, you want to, you want to stay at the exact range um, that is the max distance from her E, and when she goes to E into you, you pop Corrupting Pot, Time Warp Tonic takes effect, and then you can always outspace Gwen, and you can basically get two Qs off on her, um, even if even if you don't maintain Grass Proc. So um, that that should be, I, I I think that neither of them have probably played this matchup um, versus uh, a high level of the respective champion, if that makes sense. GP, GP Gwen is, uh, it's really, really hard for Gwen, but we're not seeing the manner in which it's hard for Gwen actually unfold. We're just seeing Gwen uh, generally uh, not being able to, to do anything here. But GP is also not doing everything he could. So this is kind of interesting. GP is staying till four. I think staying till four here is a pretty big blunder. I don't think there's any point to, uh, to stay till four. We'll see. Um... Gwen has W up. Yeah, okay, Q gonna go out. And basically what GP is just doing right now is he's keeping this barrel so Gwyneth can't can't go in. Now, using that W, ooh, okay. All right, he's gonna E forward. All right. All right, another barrel. Okay, another Q. That was fine. See, it, it's really bizarre that he's so afraid of like taking even a little bit of damage to maintain better uh, spacing. Mm. Now, this is just kind of awkward. This is just kind of awkward. All right, so Gwen's gonna TP uh, and recall. Probably gonna just get boots, boots, cloth armor. No, okay. Thought he would just get boots. There's no reason to get Dark Seal or Doran's ring over Dark Seal. The HP difference is negligible. So what Gwen needs to do right now is needs to take all of these minions with these minions and insta shove. And if he dies, he dies. I mean, there, there's no way, there's no way to play around this anymore. No, he needs to not trade. No, 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 no. He needs to hit the spellcasters because if GP cues him, then these minions aggro onto GP. No, see, he's doing it too slow. Look at this wave. This is one. This is two. We're going to call this two and see this is what I meant by if you die, you die. Um, so he did it He did it too slowly. I'm pretty sure there's a way to do this without having to die to rumble, but now he's going to try to stand his ground. Wow, they... Okay, they messed that up. Wow. Okay. He's getting away with murder right now, by the way. He's actually he's just getting away with murder. Oh my god. Well they, they both they both messed it up. There's there's no reason to, to okay, well Xin Zhao actually wants to threaten the dive. Okay. This is good what Licorice does. He stays out of vision to make it look like he's gonna recall. And I like what uh Xin Zhao is doing though, and I really like what happened here with uh LeBlanc. They're just making sure that GP actually conceded everything. So this this is pretty this is pretty nice. This is pretty nice. Okay, waves coming back in. Um, yeah, I definitely think the the ruby here is not not the play. Again, it should probably just be a dark seal or something at this point. Hmm. Okay. Both of them, the CS score is not super clean, but yeah, gang gangplank really messed up. Um, by he he stayed through four for no reason. Hello, Nemsko. Hello. <clears throat> oh, I got hosted. Yes. <laughs> I'm only paying attention to the pro view. I can't see anything. Okay. These are fine. GP should identify this now is one. This is two. It's coming. And you can see this. He should just want to get the crash. He knows... I, I'm pretty sure he knows about Zen, so he shouldn't prioritize killing the ward over just crashing the wave. So this is a little weird. Gwen's gonna come back over, eat the honey fruit. Mm, yes. 
Okay, you should just get the plate. All right, just auto it once and then leave. Yep. Okay. Yep. Just leave. Okay. So GP is doing a lot of stuff inefficiently, timing wise. Now he has to probably. Uh, I think he has to stay. I think he has to stay because I think if if not, then Gwen just walks up here, and I think everything's fine. Okay, so Gwen's playing really respectfully, I guess not wanting to get cheesed. Mm. He could, yeah, he could. He can just shove this at this point. I mean, he should just do it instantly. I don't know why he's taking so long. He should have queued. He should have queued and then just got four stacks for this wave. He should walk forward right now and just snip. I don't know what's going on. Okay, we're gonna, so we're gonna pile one and two. We're gonna pile one and two. This is three. See how he plays three? Should be no reason to stay in the wave anymore, though. There should be no reason to stay in the wave. I don't know what he's doing. He, now he's in a really awkward spot. Rumble's gonna stay top lane. Yeah, he, I mean he's doing this to himself. He's missing exp and he's missing exp and minions. He's doing it to himself. So this is um this is sort of the same thing that. I think when we watched uh, Poe Belter, right, uh, we were able to talk about, like, the incoming minion waves, um, I mean, done it for, like, a lot of lanes, but it, it definitely seems really noticeable in this pro view. The speed at which they're shoving or doing actions with their current waves relative to the incoming wave isn't, it's not a, ooh, he's looking for the solo there. It's not as ideal as it should be. No, against Gangplank, you you do want to start uh, D Shield because if GP blunders, then you can regain control of the lane. Okay, I don't know. I don't know why Licorice stayed. Why are we? What? I mean, I can't. I can't see why he's really staying. This is very suffocating. We're not. Uh, we should F key. We should. We should have F keyed. We should know what we're even running to. I. I, I don't know. That was very sudged. Okay. Yep. Yeah, definitely should have rotated for this Herald, yes. Hmm, yes. Maybe if we f would we could have known that it was always losing. Late 500, this is honestly... I think that, I think that I'm, I'm missing out on some smooth Bloodman scaling gameplay here. I don't know your thoughts on this, but... Mm, yes. <laughs> and he got Leeching Leer. You never want to go Leeching Leer um, because the item's a joke. Basically, what you want to do is you just want to get all the components. Um, you just want to get the components uh, so that you get the extra ability power from Blasting Wand. But then the other thing about getting Blasting Wand uh, while holding all the components um, is that you have more options for recalls. Uh, whereas if you go Leeching Leer, now you're stuck. You need 850. Um, and 850 can be a really bizarre recall for Gwen in a lot of lanes. Um, because typically the way that she plays is like she looks for all-ins. Usually within like a four-wave window. And if she doesn't find it, then she generally wants to reset. Uh, generally that's her play pattern. Um, maybe that sounds pretty black and white to some people, but it's not, not meant to be. Um, Gwyneth should probably just insta CS this wave. You can just go up with W. Just go up with W, pop your refill. Go. What? Rumble can't be here. Rumble can't be here. Don't W that, just use your potions. Gwyneth Paltro. Just recall. What? Okay, they want to force this. But the thing is, is that GP could just... 
Okay. Yeah, he can he can smell that it's coming, or he has a ward. I can't see. He could I, he could either smell that it's coming, or he has a ward. Okay. Uh, just insta CF, CS the wave and recall. Just insta CS it. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Reset. What do you think is the best team in the world right now? I don't know why he's staying. It's like perma bad to keep staying. You're achieving. There's no story, right? So the way that people should view a laning phase is like telling a story, right? If this was a, if this was a story, you couldn't even donate it. You know, like those like bins that you can like donate things to, like articles of clothing, toys, books. You couldn't even donate this. Okay. The person that's like in front of the bin would actually be like, "Sir, you can't give that to children." Like what? What is? This is, like, this story, is awful. This is so rough. Okay, you know when you have a really clean laning phase and everything just seems to make sense? You're getting, like, a good recall. You're pushing waves at a nice time. You're coming back, not missing CS. You have good, you have good bases, like, for buys. Like, you have, like, perfect gold and stuff. It's like everything fits. Like, like, you can either say it's like a puzzle or it's like a story, right? But the reason that story is important is because you're trying to tell the lane... Well, you're, you're trying to tell something while you're doing your laning phase, right? Um, or, I mean, we, we, we get the term from poker, right? Story. Um, you'll, you'll often hear sometimes maybe in uh, EDU videos, right? You might hear that, like, someone's story doesn't make sense. And it means the lines that they're taking um, aren't congruent with one another or not, like, ideal, etc. Um, like, this just makes no sense. Why are we here? What a great champ. Okay. It's actually similar to how chess matches played. When we play a move, we're arguing that this is a threat. Don't know enough about chess. Yeah, Gwen is immune, as. Nano21, thank you for subbing. Um, GP Boots, yeah, he wants Swifties again. This just seems to be a thing that he does. He should just freeze now. He should just freeze. Why isn't he freezing? What? What? Uh, okay. I maybe maybe he's thinking that Roomble is coming down. I actually don't know. Wait a sec. Okay, okay. GP is the one that has blue trinket. Okay. Also, it's weird. Uh, not no. Ah, oh, well, you know what? Actually, there's no, there's no. Yeah, there's no tanks on enemy team. I was gonna say Blunder could maybe be okay. Also, he didn't swap off uh, yellow trinket. Okay, freeze, 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 freeze. Hot day, I guess. We got a hot day. We got to be somewhere. Yeah. Yeah, the uh, the Varus and, and them, they can really move your mid laner right now. Yeah, LeBlanc is in danger. Mm, yes. Mm, yes, yes. Yeah, we really need to really need to shove this wave.
I hope that GP gets the remnants of this wave. I hope that he gets all five CS. And then I hope he gets this wave. Let's see, where is he? Okay, so yeah, he got that minion. Okay. So we just we just gave GP a hundred gold and maybe about fifteen percent of a level. Yeah, so now we're gonna group mid. Oh, wow, look, even if you were here, it doesn't change anything. And you guys had no business shoving. Wow. Wow, maybe we could have F keyed and known that there was no reason to summon a Herald. Now GP, GP actually gets a kill and an EXP worth. Okay, so here's the funny thing, okay? The, the gold denial and the EXP by freezing two waves is greater than the gold obtained by Rift Heralding the mid turret and killing it. There's no objective out on the map. They're giving up. You have camps up on the left hand side, and then LeBlanc is busy in top. Just freeze again. Where, where do you have to be? You just gave GP another kill worth the gold. Dude, why don't people think of it like this, man? Well, actually, it looks like he's not here. Okay, so it now, okay. Well, LeBlanc's going to CS the wave instantly. She's going to CS it instantly. I can't, I, well, I can't, I can't actually see, but like. I don't, I don't know how much remains from that wave. But he's got, he's. <sighs> okay, G, all right, GP, GP is there. But like, he could have just been denied all of this. Nothing is being achieved by shoving. No one cares, dude. Look at the minimap. No one cares. Now, Gwen does light up turrets pretty quick, but like, wait, what's the dragon? What's the dragon? Is it infernal? Ooh. All right, it's infernal. Yeah, we can't fight. 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 Should just be doing our camps. Yeah, Gwyneth, Gwyneth Paltrow does light up turrets. Nice try. Nice try. Okay. Should go and look for... Should look for raptors, maybe? No, no. That's not a kill. Nope. Varus has to blunder for you to kill him. Nope. Nope. Should have just taken the raptors. We don't even know what we're running to. We don't even know what we're running to. I don't even... It's so suffocating. What is going on? Oh, maybe Rise is dead. Wait, what? No, no, no. Rise... No, Varus has to really blunder to die here. You can't move mi... If you have to constantly look for opponents to fuck up in order to win, then it probably means that you're doing something horrendously bad minutes in advance. Holy moly. All the jungle camps are up. They should just do all the jungle camps. Licorice's gameplay was so bad my ADHD triggered and I ended up yelling so loud my dorm neighbor woke up GG Licorice. What? What? <laughs> what? 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 Okay. All right, freeze that wave. Freeze. He gave us a cannon. Let's freeze. We got we got Omnivamp. Let's control. Why? Why, man? Why? We could have just We could have denied a kill. Could have denied a kill. And golden EXP! 
Oh, we're gonna die. Oh, we're gonna. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, we're gonna die. If we're gonna. We're gonna die. Oh. Okay. Well, we still ended up denying three. We we ended up denying three. There's no camps for Zen though. There's no camps for Zen. Definitely, you know. Wait, what are we? Okay. The 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 issue is is that so gangplank I'm pretty sure can actually get all of those minions and you achieve nothing regardless. Um. So here's the thing. I think Gangplank can get all of those minions. Yes, he was end he ended up being denied three in the end. But the problem is, is that it puts you more overextended, and then the follow up sixty to ninety seconds from now is also bad for you. So it doesn't it doesn't really matter that like you're looking for a flip in the moment. Okay, Shin Shin Zhao. Nice data man, ten gifted. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Whoa. Gwyneth Paltrow. Nice. That was good. That was... Oh, well, that's not good. Oh. It's still... It's still... It's still worth. It's still worth, for sure. It's still worth, for sure. Okay. Still worth, for sure. Definitely not... 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 Not down bad. Because it was... It was a... It was a shutdown, right? So... I think that's... Yeah, I think that's fine. Okay, what is um what is he getting next? He gets Zanya's hourglass. I think Zanya's uh I guess it's fine. Why licorice POV? Because I only have option to watch either licorice or Bob Jenkins. Um Okay. So I can't I can't see what's happening in the fight. I really, it, it's really like it's suffocating. I can't actually tell what's happening. A lot of these times, I can't tell what's going on. Like I don't have enough information to know how I should want to move on. Like Gwen. I mean that's how like I'm feeling. You know what I mean? Like that or when I say that like I don't have enough information, what I mean is like. If I were Gwen in this spot, I feel as though I don't have enough info to know how I want to move. If that makes sense. Okay, this is... Gwyneth Paltrow. Oh, Gwen! Gonna eat out? Okay. Oh, nice try, nice try. Tried to, he tried to eat the barrel. That was, uh, that was something. He should do, he should do blue. Yep, he should do blue and he should keep F keying to the fight. He should keep F keying and space barring. You guys, you guys know I did it. I did it. Um, you know what? Actually, I remember there was a good instance, and the reason that I remember there's a good instance is because someone told me that they were about I to throw up. Um, there was a thing. Mm, maybe I'll. Uh, no, I probably can't find it. I'll, you know what? Actually, yeah, I, I I will try to find it. I'll try to find a good example of what I'm talking about there. When you when you F key and you still keep doing exactly what you're doing. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll find I'll find the example for you guys. I'll find the example really quick. Let me let me find it. Let me find it. Let me find it. Uh. uh. Let me find it. I'm trying to find it for you. I will find it. I will find it. I know that I'm 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 kind of pause champing right now, but I will Hello, find it. Hello, how are you today? I am pause champing. Wait, give me a little bit.
Hold on. Yeah, it's here. It's here. I found it. I found it. All right, ready? Watch. Ready? Here. This is yesterday. Ready? So take a look at uh, take a look at set on the mini map. Okay. So take a look at set. They're about to trade. Wait, I think there's a fight. There's a fight. Never mind. I'll show. I'm an idiot, guys. I'm an idiot. Let's we let's rewind. There's a fight. <laughs> okay. Well, he looked at the Baron. All right, let's rewind. I'm sorry. Holy shit. I want to show a important example of how you do it. Because it's not too hard to learn. It's just a certain way to hold your camera. Ooh. Okay, that is a... All right, W... Oh, Zanya's instantly... Oh, oh, wait. This isn't that bad. Oh, wait. Oh, that was... Oh, wait. Oh, wait. If everyone was actually here... Wait, what are Ezreal and Zin doing? Uh, I guess they can't actually get in. No, they're just... Not, okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Never mind. Never mind. There's nothing they can actually do. There's nothing they, they can actually do. Oh, okay. Yeah, they just got aced. Wait, is that the end of the game? Is that... Guys? Yeah. Okay. They FF'd. <laughs> Oh my lord. Yeah. I'll show the example after the game. Okay. Yeah, this is just going to be a slow a slow bleed and the game's going to end. Yep. Thank you to Tony for sobbing. Palafox was top 50 Korea. Mm, all that it, well, the way that he plays in solo queue, if you watch a lot of his games, he has good mechanics, but I don't know. It's sort of like, it's sort of like me, like me playing in the scrims. Um, the, the enemy support is, Almost challenger, right? But I thought the enemy's support was pretty clueless on laning. So it's really easy in laning to just outplay the person. Because the, the enemy's support doesn't get so many nuance about, like, laning when both players are aware. But what the enemy's support's, like, really good at is on-the-fly mechanics. No, this is just actually, like, a real thing. I mean, it's the same time. It's the, it's the same thing as when I played scrims in 2019. Even even against like LPL players, they're just they're really thoughtless on laning. They're very good mechanically, but they don't know what the hell they're doing. So in a controlled environment, it's pretty easy to take advantage of them. I'm I'm being super serious right now. Like I I don't know I don't I don't know how I mean there's literally. Recorded vods of it. Mm, they're gonna try to make something happen here, but I feel like the game's just busted wide open. But yeah, I think yeah, Palafox getting really high on the ladder um, is fine, but like, ladder is not. Ladder isn't indicative. Um, of a lot of a lot of things um, there's a lot of LCK play well they're like all of the ultra uber elite LCK players like Chovy and stuff yeah they always are really really high um, but at the same time you will find certain good LCK players that are actually like 600 700 like I think ruler I think rulers like 700 Deft is also Deft is also known for not being uber high. Sometimes he makes high runs. Um, 
Well, being uber high on Korean ladder means something. Uber high is like 20. Top 20. Yes. Wait, they might actually just get Elder. This is, uh... So, basically, if you're Team Liquid right now, all that you do, if you're TL, is... Wait, did they end? You wouldn't even know, though. You wouldn't, you wouldn't even, you wouldn't even know. You wouldn't even know if they're ending, by the way. Dude, like, it's... I feel like I could drown. <laughs> like... Wait, 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 watch, watch the on the way pick. On the way! They, they were there, they were there eight seconds ago! <laughs> I'm on the way. Alright. <laughs> Nah, that's fine. I think there's nothing they can do though. Wait, let's see. Is there is there counterplay? Um, I guess at this point Gwen had to go over the wall and start recalling. Like right now. But the issue the issue is is that Gwen is like mm, Gwen's pretty important. Yeah. Maybe there's no way to stop this, yeah. Even if they it, it, okay, even if they start recalling Let's see. Okay, Gwen would have to E right now, E in the brush, and then recall, so she'd land at 3207. There's nothing Gwen can do. It's 30 it's 3205, the game's over. There's nothing there Gwen can't do anything. What is, what is Ezreal and LeBlanc doing? I guess I would have to see what Ezreal and LeBlanc are doing, but maybe just nothing. Or maybe there's a lot of minions? I don't know. I, I wish I could know, but I just, I don't know. That's all I'm saying. I don't know. Yeah, it looks like they're clearing supers. But, like, I couldn't even see the HP on the the Nexus and, and whatnot. Kind of, kind of says. Okay, let's show you guys the example of, um... Alright, look. Can you guys see this? Let me make sure this is, like, visible. Okay. So, you see Wukong and Set? This is how you do it. Okay? You notice that my movements aren't really being impeded? Pretty sure I'm able to even notice that uh, Set or the Flash. Yeah. Flash. Yeah, see? I'm not, I'm, it's not affecting anything that I'm doing. Now, Wukong's not going to tell me that set flashes. Okay. Now, I understand that, like, in a, in a when you have comms, you don't need someone to say that set flashed. Flash. But you as yourself can, like, use this information to maybe make your own choices. Flash. Now, obviously, in, in this spot, like, nothing, like, it's not going to alter any of my choices. But, th I mean, this is how you do it, right? Um... Unfortunately, you can't see my hand, but it's not hard. 